In The Last Angry Man, by Gerald Green, the narrative centers on the character of Sam Clay, a dedicated and principled physician in a lower-class neighborhood of New York City. Clay's life is defined by his unwavering commitment to his patients, despite the personal and professional sacrifices he endures. The novel paints a vivid portrait of Clay's struggle against the systemic inadequacies and societal neglect that characterize the healthcare system of the time. The story unfolds against the backdrop of an era marked by increasing social and economic disparities. Clay represents an ideal of medical ethics and altruism, contrasting sharply with the corruption and self-interest that pervade the world around him. His practice, a small, run-down clinic, becomes a microcosm for the larger societal issues at play. The narrative delves deeply into Clay's character, showcasing his relentless drive to provide care to those who cannot afford it and his disdain for the bureaucracy and corruption within the medical field. Green's portrayal of Clay is both heroic and tragic. Clay's relentless pursuit of justice and compassion often comes at a personal cost. His health deteriorates, and his financial stability is perpetually in jeopardy, yet he remains steadfast in his mission. This dedication to his patients underscores a broader commentary on the ethics of care and the responsibilities of those in positions of power. The tension in the novel is heightened by Clay's interactions with other characters, each representing different facets of society. His conflicts with insurance companies, hospitals, and even his own family highlight the systemic obstacles he faces. The portrayal of these interactions serves as a critique of a system that prioritizes profit over people, underscoring the moral dilemmas that Clay confronts. The novel also explores the personal sacrifices Clay makes in his quest to serve others. His relationships with his family are strained, as they struggle to understand his unrelenting dedication to his work. This tension is further exacerbated by the financial strain and emotional toll that his work imposes on his personal life. Clay's family's struggles serve to humanize him, revealing the cost of his ideals and the loneliness that often accompanies such a singular focus. The narrative structure of The Last Angry Man effectively captures the internal and external conflicts faced by Clay. Green uses a mix of dialogue and introspection to provide insight into Clay's thoughts and motivations. This approach allows readers to engage deeply with Clay's character and understand the complexities of his struggle. Green's writing style is evocative and poignant, painting a stark picture of the realities faced by those at the margins of society. The descriptions of Clay's clinic, the neighborhoods he serves, and the various obstacles he encounters are vivid and compelling. This detailed portrayal enhances the reader's immersion in the narrative and underscores the thematic concerns of the novel. In conclusion, The Last Angry Man is a powerful exploration of one man's struggle against a flawed system. Gerald Green's portrayal of Sam Clay as a figure of unwavering moral integrity and compassion offers a critical perspective on the ethics of care and the challenges faced by those who seek to make a difference in an imperfect world. Through Clay's personal sacrifices and professional battles, Green highlights the profound impact of individual dedication in the face of systemic failure. The novel remains a poignant reflection on the cost of altruism and the enduring fight for justice and compassion in the face of adversity.